What is going on everybody? So this is going to be the video why I did this. Given the current state of things, it's always helpful to be prepared for pretty much about anything. Because you just don't know what's going on. And, you know, with the COVID and all that stuff, everybody's wearing masks. Right? Well, cloth mask may or may not do anything. I'm not a scientist. I have my personal opinion, but I'll leave it at that. It's my personal opinion. And there are surgical masks, there's N95 masks, there's N99 masks, there's a full re there's uh, respirators, there's full mask respirators, things like that. Now Uncle Al, Die Bullfrog79, he's been stressing on us, stressing on us, stressing on us, everybody all of us who had uh, beards and everything like that. And we need to shave them. You can shave them, shave them, shave them. Because the problem is, is when you have a beard, you don't get a good seal with that mask. Now, anybody who's been in the military, they know. Pretty much you can't have a beard for anything. There are some exemptions for shave bumps. Uh, now I believe there are religious exemptions and things like that. But when in combat, you lose it. Those exemptions are out the wall because mission has to come first. But, again, one of my problems is right here. I have glasses. I can't see without my glasses, really. Now, I have uh, acquired a gas mask. We'll leave it at acquired. And this is the actual issue... U.S. Army gas mask. But as you can see, I will not be able to wear this with my glasses. Now I put out a post uh, a while back asking if anybody had the glasses inserts. And at the time, nobody did. So I went to look him. And I could not get goggles or anything like that, like sunglasses, anything along those lines, in my prescription because I have an astigmatism. My pupils are jacked up so but what I did find were these just swim goggles obviously now I'm blind as bat but my eyes are different prescriptions one's a six one's a 5.75 so pretty close these are both sixes so I can wear these and I can see pretty darn good now with these I can wear this and still put on the gas mask. Now the seal is not perfect, uh, but given the current environment that I'm in, I'm not having to worry about biological uh, contaminants, nuclear contaminants. The most I would have to worry about would be uh, CS type uh, contaminants. What I did, is one of my buddies, who is still in the military, no, I did not acquire this mask from him, he just had laser surgery done. And he had the inserts. So these are the actual inserts that go inside the mask. Uh, they will literally fit right inside here. And that way you can see. So I'm going to turn around, uh, drop the camera down so that you guys can kind of see, hopefully, me putting these in. All right, here we go. So you got your gas mask here. That's been a long, long time since I've had these. So the theory is simply you just put them in just like that. Now, this particular one, these don't exactly fit this, but it's good enough for me to be able to see. So let me put it on real quick. So, as you can tell, I hope you can hear me. Wow, this sounds weird. There's a sound's coming out of this thing. I've got my glasses in, and I can see just fine. So, you know, if you're blind as a bat, and you can find them, these are a good option. All I did was I went to the, uh, just to, one of the eyeglass places with my prescription. 
They made the lenses, put them in. So, uh, so yeah. So if you wear glasses, that's those are pretty much the only two options that I know of because you don't want to wear contacts in any sort of situation where you might get a chemical irritant in your eye because it's a good chance that those contacts might melt and that would just suck. Stay safe out there, everybody.